What's up guys, Yana here. Welcome back to Shadow of the Tomb Raider. Didn't I get that? The younger Croft is more active and less cerebral than her father was. Although intelligent, she is less focused on the meaning and history of the artifacts she seeks and more prone to risk taking. With no children or family of her own, she is free to pursue her targets, almost to the point of obsession. Although this can make her appear impulsive or unpredictable at times, we believe her drive and the balance of her personality will make her easier to influence with the promise of greater challenge and more likely to deliver results. <sighs> Any information she might have that Richard Croft withheld from Trinity would simply be a bonus. We recommend her as a strong target for recruiting. <laughs> we laughed at the same time. Well, it was funny. We're sealing everything up because Commander Rourke said to hold the perimeter. No one goes in or out. I know that, smartass, but you know why? That's above my pay grade. When the recon team gets here, maybe they'll be able to tell us something. After action report. Attention, Dr. Dominguez. Search site, Mazaruni River, Guyana. 5.816587-5910. Four six eight one five eight. Discovered evidence of Maya migration. Upon subsequent investigation, site deemed a dead end. Actions taken. Site flooded by redirecting river. Locals recruited for labor eliminated. All trace of presence scrubbed. Other. Kick up at nearby village. Lethal response necessary. Area isolated. Site flooded appears natural. South American rivers rising due to climate change story seeded in media. Apocalypse is coming. Okay, let's do that. <gasps> Beautiful. Okay. Ooh. Orvenir, this is Commander Rourke. Have you achieved lockdown? We're almost there. All access points are covered, and most of the barricades are finished. Almost isn't good enough. Secure the perimeter now, and make damn sure it's locked tight. Aye, sir. Uh, if I could ask, sir, what's going on? Recon team is on route. Oh. Rourke out. Was there any indication what might be happening before we lost contact? Was that it? I guess. No, 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 no. I don't see the other guy. Went down and didn't come up. Oh, they're far. Okay. Too many structures in here. The sight lines are shit. I just want to do it. Don't mind me. I don't understand how this could have happened. Shouldn't we send someone down to look for them? Rourke was explicit. No search and rescue until the... Great. Oh, they saw me. They saw me. Well, they sensed me. She's using too much to hide. How? Christ! How did she get in the
Okay, that was a fail. <laughs> I didn't want it that way. Is there anyone else here? Okay, the perimeter's locked down. All we have to do is wait for the recon. Team. Doesn't it seem a little weird to you? There was a problem they underground. Didn't hear the we were fortifying ourselves from a threat from overland. Seems pretty standard. If something did go wrong, we should assume it could be anything. We've got the temple covered, too. I don't know, man. It still feels like we went from an amber alert in a known area to a red alert all over the place. We've been overreacting to things ever since that storm hit. Okay, if I go here. Those were good men. Are. They are good men. What do you think happened down there? We're securing the site. Obviously somebody thinks they got attacked. By what? There's nothing down there. You sure? We were searching for something. Maybe they found it, and it wasn't what we thought. What am I supposed to do now? The recon team will figure this out. Now he cannot see me. I hate this site. Like some creepy ghost town. Okay. God damn it. I must be going crazy. God damn it, she's hunting us. <laughs> ah, that was nice. That was very nice. That was awesome. I like that. Jonah, Commander Walk is here in Peru. He ordered Trinity to lock down a dig site below an old oil well. You going to check it out? Yeah, I'll see what they found. Walk was there in Cozumel when Dominguez took the dagger. They must have figured out the next step to the hidden city. been a bloodbath here. What happened? Aren't you scared? Because I am. I don't have enough space for that. Okay. Okay, there's... Those things. And it means there's going to be a fight. Attention, Dr. Dominguez. Possible entry point located for temple outside of Kwakyaku. Excavation equipment en route. a trap to me, but it's not a trap. Okay. What the hell happened? Okay. What 
What the hell? From death to life, new moon to full, this temple serves as guardian to the silver box. Oh. Nice. Inside the temple. I think we found something here too. Some numbers. I'm gonna clear it off. Okay. Have to match the symbols. That's a puzzle, I guess. Match the symbols. The numbers on the pillars look like the first half of dates. Ishal on the left. Shack shell on the right. Have to match the symbols. Oh my god. Uh, is there an artifact or something I have that might help me? <laughs> I have no idea what the hell is that. In the Maya long count calendar, all dates have five numbers. This numeral was damaged to look like a 13, but what if it's really the an eight? Number, the left That's a 2,000 year difference, and the constellations would be in a completely different position. I'm sorry to interrupt you. Okay, this is, uh, where is it? Oh, it's not that. Have to match the symbols. Definitely something. I'm pressing wrong buttons. I'm sorry. There's definitely something here because uh, I mean, how would I know? This is the star Alfad to find the hidden. Cinnabar was... No. From death to life. Okay. Those worthy shall be... This is the flag. No. I must find something that has dates what am I supposed to do now have to match the symbols okay maybe I shouldn't have panicked to 
open these doors. match the symbols. I don't understand a thing. Oh. I think that's it. And here it's have too much this, not these. Okay, let me take a look. I have no idea. turning is the last one so I guess I'm doing it right and here it should be blank happen if I if it is wrong. Hey Jonah, any progress? Uh, there's an incomplete date and a depiction of Shuck Shell. I have two dates here and E Shell. I think I've seen the date on the left somewhere. The photo from Cozumel. Maybe there's a clue. Okay. In the Maya long count calendar. All dates have five numbers. This numeral was damaged to look like a 13. But what if it's really an eight? That's a 2,000 year difference and the constellations would be in a completely different position. So the star path would lead west to somewhere in Peru. Okay, I found a detail which says the last number of the left pillar is zero. 
The last number of the left pillar should be a zero. This thing like a ring? Oh my god, I have no idea. Okay, Jonah, what's the final number for Shack Shell? A line across with two dots on top of it. Seven, I think. Thanks. Suicide was not considered forbidden by the Maya. In fact, it was considered an honorable alternative to living. Because of this, by committing suicide, you could bypass the underworld and go straight to paradise, where other noble deaths included the sacrificed, those who died in battle or childbirth, and those who died playing ball. The suicide's escort on the journey to paradise would be this goddess, Ishtab, also called Rope Woman. She was the goddess of suicides, especially those who hanged themselves and manifested as a rotting corpse hanging from a noose. <laughs> oh my god, that's so weird. I mean... Balam is the Maya word for Jaguar. The Maya idolized Jaguars for their majestic beauty and dangerous grace. Villagers would have four Akantunes, idols which they placed at each corner of the village. At night, five Balams, spirit Jaguar guardians, would come to the village. One Balam would station itself at each corner, next to an Akantun, while the fifth and smallest Balam would coordinate their protection efforts against evil demons and spirits. Huh. Jonah. Hey, Lara. It's Abby. Oh, hey, Abby. I found a mural. It seems to depict some kind of journey. Entering through a jaguar mouth follows a serpent toward a silver eye. Uh huh. On the way, there's a spider and an eagle that rises toward a temple. Okay, I don't know about most of that. But the jaguar mouth is back this way. Really? Yeah. Cat sculpture, big teeth. Oh, here. He's back. Laura, you okay? Yeah, I'm heading. This is the path to the hidden city. I'm sorry, it seems to describe you. a series of trials entering through a jaguar mouth. A spider and an eagle that rises toward a temple, leading to a serpent with a silver eye. Back. Good. I think you're gonna like this. This describes something nearby. Two guardians have fangs. Two guardians have feet. One guardian has both to better protect me. Use a rope bar to kill and string up an enemy. Okay, I want a camp. This 
This shows a basic sketch for a temple, rising from the middle of a city. If I squint, it sort of looks like a snake. written, I just didn't read it. Okay. Go fast, go fast, don't die, don't die, don't die, please. for today it was quite intense I hope you continue watching and support me because it really matters to me thank you so much for watching really like and subscribe love to you next time bye